What's up, everybody? In today's blog, we want to look at two forms of training. One is hit, and one is strength training. Should you do both, or should you just concentrate on one? We're going to look at the pros and cons of each as we go through this uh, in this podcast. First of all, let's compare hit and strength training. HIT stands for High Intensity Interval Training, H-I-I-T. HIT workouts alternate between intense short bouts and recovery or low intensity periods. The idea is to get the heart rate up very high, recover slightly, and then do it again. For example, you might sprint 200 meters at the track, jog 200, and repeat for 10 or 12 reps. Strength training, on the other hand, is a broad category of workouts that focus on building muscle strength and our size, lifting weights, using resistance bands, bodybuilding, bodyweight exercises, and using weight machines. That all, all of those count as strength training. Strength training is more anaerobic, while HIIT is more aerobic. Some of the benefits of HIIT workouts improve both aerobic and anaerobic fitness, lowers insulin resistance, improves glucose tolerance, burns calorie, results in significant fat loss. So here can be a great workout. Now, let's look at strength training. Strength training Benefits. Benefits of strength training. What are the benefits of strength training? The benefits of strength training. Strength training also has its benefits. Some of those overlap with HIIT, high intensity interval training. The benefits of strength training, it increases muscle mass, it slows muscle loss, the accompanying com, aging, it improves bone density and joint flexibility, strength training reduces injuries. Strength training also reduces injuries. Research also shows that strength training is a powerful way to lose weight, a walk to maintain a heavy weight and lose fat. Strength training is a powerful way to lose weight, especially compared to steady state cardio. So uh, in your training, or if you are receiving training, if you're a female, don't skip weights. Men and women should both benefit from the, from strength training. So men and women should do weights. For well, optimal health benefits, you need to combine HIIT and strength training. You need both cardio and strength training. With the added benefits, benefits of HIIT cardio, doing both provides the most advantage. So your best shot for optimal health and to get the optimal health benefits to do HIIT training and strength training. Combine them. Do both. If you are on a diet you, to lose body fat and focus on weight loss, using both types of workouts will be your best option. Because studies show that the combination of strength training and the cardio and the exercise routine maximizes fat loss and healthy weight. You also can do it separately. You can do the hit and the strength workout separately, as well as combine. So if you don't want to combine them, you, you can do them separately.
you may want to separate these two workouts if you have the time and if your schedule allows you to. By separating it, you can maximize the results of each exercise routine individually. So you can do your hip, maximize that out, and then do your strength and maximize that out. But if you don't have the time, it's probably best to combine them. So the time saver is to combine your hit and your strength training. Some of the benefits of combining them, doing them on the same day, they have more significant strength improvements. You have more than more significant strength improvements and more than of the 10 exercises used for the use, the minimum intensity group allows or uh, show improvements in some exercises by the hit group improves and all. So the, the combination of, if you combine them, studies show that your strength improvements, you have strength improvements. Also, significant fat loss. Now, if you already spend most of your time on lifting or some or some other strength training workouts, it may be easier to make some adjustments to turn one or two sections per week into high intensity interval training. Hell, some things you can do to make it an easy transition. Shorten your rest periods so when you work out for hit, the goal is to get your heart rate seriously elevated. One way you can get the same effect with weights to take less time to rest in between sets. Second one is add in more compound movements. For your hit strength days, focus on compound movements. Compound movements that work the entire large muscle groups. Think lunges and push-ups instead of lat pull-downs and bicep curls. Also, you need to add cardio. Take some of your strength movements to the next level with cardio moves. And last but not least, increase your weights. Heavy, lift, heavy lifting, lifting is important for major strength gain, but also decreases your heart rate. Use bigger weights and fewer reps for a hit section. So, hope that helps you a little bit to decide whether you want to concentrate on HIIT training or strength training or you want to combine both. For more information on this, you can contact contact me at um, my information on my about page or you can contact any um, it's a certified personal trainer. And we'll be uh, more than happy to give you a further breakdown on the difference between strength training and high interval high intensity interval training. I'm sorry. So until next time, hope you're doing some some workout, some training was high interval, high intensity interval training or uh, Strength training. If we've said in one uh, another video, you have to move it. Move it daily. Get out and walk. Run. Go to the gym. Lift weights. If you can't get to a gym, set your own uh, area up to work out. But work, make make working out a daily routine. Make sure you keep up with your cardio. Also, make sure you do your, an your anaerobic exercises, strength training, all of that's important for males and females. Eat healthy, eat clean, drink eight glasses of water daily, try to get six to eight hours of sleep, hopefully eight, 
at least six. So glad you stopped by. Hope you like this uh, kind of information. If you um, would, please hit that thumb up button, the thumbs up button, hit the like button, which is the thumbs up button. <laughs> Subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment on the video. So until next time, peace, blessings. Be with you always. I'm out.